I, I used to be around in circles, not so much anymore, where people would be saying, I just need to know what the right thing to do is. And what bothered me was the singularities present in that sentence, a sentence full of anxiety and desire to do well in the world and desire to do well by your community. The right thing to do is, and you think, I don't know, what, what do you want it to be? Um, Father Jerry Reynolds is an extraordinary man. Sinn Féin uh, credit him with bringing them to the table of negotiation um, in the 80s, uh, 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 negotiations that led to ceasefires and then subsequently the peace agree uh, agreements. And he, um, he was a total dreamer. He died when he was 80. We were very close friends. At his funeral, one of the priests said, Father Jerry was a man who all of his life had both his feet firmly planted in midair. And uh, he was such a dreamer, and, and that was the whole point, is he allowed his dreams to embody a very gentle way of speaking to people who he would otherwise have been frightened of. And he arrived in Belfast at the age of 50, or maybe 48 or something like that. So he had this entire life that happened beforehand, because at that stage I was really worried about what am I supposed to do, do I have a vocation, do I have this, do I have that, this idea that I have to get it right and I have to get it right right now. And then Jerry was saying, oh yeah, I did this, I worked as a journalist, I went there, I did this course here, it was really interesting, and later in life I reflected back on what I learned from that. And I realised there's no rush uh, in terms, of, and he had oriented his life around the doing of the good, and he did that in the context of a religious community, he was a redemptorist priest. And you realise there's nothing to be frightened of, both in form, he had form, but also in freedom, because with form he found great freedom. And I think that's a narrative about poetry, it's a narrative about any art form, but it's also a narrative about a life. Mm -hmm.